Hello YouTube, welcome back to another video. This is 2E0 IQJ. This is just a quick video before the new year just to say I hope you all had a good Christmas. I certainly did and one of the presents I got was this retro tech book from the Nostalgic Nerd. On the front we've got a NES, a Vectrex, a IBM monitor, a VIC-20 and a Spectrum. Now page 61 which is goes on all about the Acorn BBC and Micro and when it came out with 32 kilobytes of memory it was £335. Nice gigabyte rubbish you kids play with. Proper computing. This is this is teach you how to do computing. Nice modern crap. Windows 10 rubbish. Anyway, £335 for a 16k model. Uh, 32k model, sorry. And it's uh, eight colours and a MOS Technology 6502 processor. So I should look forward to going through that. And that's the retro tech from Nostalgic Nerd. I had a, a comment coming in Christmas Day where I got my Arrow 2 antenna from. And it came from, uh, well, it would have come from um, arrowantennas.com. However, they no longer sell them on their website. So I got it from moonraker.au. I think that's the website I used. I'll link the website I used below in the description. I'll link it where I got it from. And they're going for around about £150. So, yes, it is a considered purchase. But you want to work satellites and stuff. It's easy to put together and can fit in a bag. Now, it doesn't actually come with a bag. I'm just using a, an old tripod bag that I got from, from a car boot or something. Or a, a charity shop 50p. Literally, you can take that about with you, and you can uh, work satellites when you put the antenna together. It takes about two weeks to put it together. But I am looking at replacing the cable because mine's uh, the end of my cable. Cable's going a bit funny. Um, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Um, so if anyone knows to replace cable in our antenna, put it in the comments below. So in the new year, we've got this antenna to play with. So I'll do a video on this. And this is a Pro Whip antenna. It's all in there. I just need to get hold of some coax, which I've got, and also I need to get hold of something that I can bolt it to, so a ground spike, something like that, and I think I can use that washing line spike I bought um, off Amazon uh, last summer. So we can have a little play with that new year, see if we can work any contacts out and about in the field. Um, not sure what bands this covers. I think it might be, uh, I think it might be a 40, 20, 80, or something like that, or 40, 20, 10, something like that. I'm not, I'm not sure. I have to. I will do a bit of research on this antenna and see what sort of a see what we can do with it when I when the weather improves. Also got coming up in the new year, we've got a, a software defined radio to play with. None of this USB dongle rubbish. I found my Icon PCR 1000, so I'll do a video on that at some point. And it needs Windows 95. Oh, Windows Apple use using Windows. Believe it or not, I was a Windows user up to about. 12, 13 ye years ago. So I've got an old Windows laptop and we look at the SDR receiver which is uh, Icon PCR 1000. And this hand little box here, I've got bundles of cables for programming radios which is uh, also quite good. So I just want to say thank you very much for your support over the last year on my channel. Thanks for watching my videos and have a good new year. I'll see you in 2019. This is 2E0 IQJ73s. Catch you later.